one of you guys. <laughs> it's one of you guys! Hello guys, welcome to the vlog. Welcome back to Los Angeles. We are here with the LA vlogs. We are like actually making it happen. We're gonna start this vlog off with a grocery haul because I just did quite the haul on Instacart. I think Instacart is all throughout the US. I'm not totally sure, but regardless, it's like the best thing that's ever happened to me. As you guys know, I don't drive. I'm not trying to like walk with a million grocery bags back home. So Instacart, basically you can like order groceries online. And what's even better, this is not sponsored by the way. What's even better is that you get to see exactly what you're picking, like the exact item that you'll get instead of like post-mating it. And then they kind of pick which Whichever one, they tend to get the more expensive one. You can pick exactly what you want. If you guys use my code, you get $10 off your groceries and I also get $10 off groceries. But let me show you guys what I got. All right, so the first thing I got is another one of these Starbucks iced coffees. I have the medium roast. It's just nice to have this in the morning. To go with that, we have the sugar-free French vanilla coffee mate creamer. This is the best. My favorite ranch, the jalapeno ranch. This is it, so good. Two things of lemonade Mio. Three things of the steam fresh cream spinach for when I'm lazy and just want a snack. Fresh blueberries. I'm actually gonna do this thing I saw on Pinterest where you take the blueberries and you dip them into blueberry Greek yogurt and you freeze them and then they end up being like little chocolate balls, kind of. I mean, not at all. I'll do it and I'll show you guys. I also got some cherry tomatoes. These are great as like a little snack and also I think I'm probably gonna put them into a salad that I'm gonna make. I got the blueberry Greek yogurt. Three things of my hard boiled eggs. I haven't had these in a hot minute and I really missed them. They are so good. Then we got some feta cheese, because I'm gonna make some salad with that. Baby spinach, broccoli, cauliflower from my curry rice bowl, green onion, cilantro, two things of my wraps, and lastly, some sharp cheddar cheese. That's my little haul. Today is Saturday. It is currently one in the afternoon, so we have the whole day to get things done. I am going to fully Marie Kondo my life. I've never watched tidying up or any of her stuff, but people always talk about sparking joy and stuff like that. So I'm gonna film a main channel video today fully Marie kondo my life, or at least my bedroom and my office. And then I wanna finish my Disney blog post. So I'm gonna put all this away and then I'm gonna start figuring out, maybe I'll, mm, what do I wanna do first here? Yeah. Hello. I am free. All right, okay, good, because I did something and I need someone to talk to about it. What do you do? It is now 3.30. This day is actually like getting away from me and it's stressing me out a little bit. Did my makeup and now I guess I'm gonna start on the Marie kondo in my life because I just finished the blog post, but I'm actually gonna make a snack first. I haven't had one of my little deviled eggs in so long, so I'm just gonna make it as a little mid-afternoon snack right now. Got my snack, we have two eggs, and I realized while I was making them, I was like, this is just me procrastinating, isn't it? Like, I'm not even hungry. I, I just decided, oh, let's make myself a snack. And then very well knowing that when I eat my snacks, I like to watch a YouTube video or something, so I'm about to sit down on my couch and procrastinate. Why do I do this? I'm telling you that I'm doing it and I'm shaking my head at myself and I'm still doing it. I'm still searching for the video that I'm gonna watch right now. It's okay, it'll be fine. All right, it's time to get this-ish started. Also, can we talk about these slippers? I mean, they're amazing. I've been living in them since I got them the other day and they're just so soft and Fuzzy. They also come in pink, but I got the like grayish purple color. I'll have them linked down below in case you guys want to check them out for yourself. Like, look at the fuzz. Look how fuzzy they are. All right, gotta take the tripod and get this started. Also, this is not just garbage bags. This is stuff getting donated. It is a little while later. It's now 7.45 and I am hungry. So I'm taking a break from filming my main channel. I'm probably gonna film for another two hours after I eat, but I'm going to make myself some dinner now. I'm actually gonna make myself some cauliflower gnocchi. It's so good. I love it so much. It's probably one of my favorite dinners right now. So I'm heating up some oil on my pan and then we're gonna get back to work. But I have so much to do tonight. Like I'll probably be working until midnight. It's okay. This is what I told myself I was gonna do today because I was gonna do it yesterday, but then I did it. And tomorrow's gonna be like a full day out without working. So today's the day I'm just gonna like work my ass off and get you done. We're gonna cook and I will show you my food when it's done. Dinner is done. So I use the cauliflower gnocchi from Trader Joe's and then I use the organic marinara, some garlic, some spinach, nutritional yeast, salt, pepper, garlic powder, some cayenne for some spice. That's about it. Very easy, honestly. Ended up taking a longer break than anticipated. Now 9.15 and I'm getting back to work. I'll literally be working until, well no, maybe I'll stop at 11. I'll let you guys know when I'm done and then I'm gonna do a face mask tonight. I told myself, 
do a face mask. It is 11.15 and I just finished up all my work for today. It's not like fully done, but it's done for today. I'm tired. I'm actually like too lazy to do a face mask. I'm just gonna get into bed and watch some shows. But I did finish Gossip Girl, so I'm sad and I don't really know what to watch now. Actually, well, I was gonna say maybe I'll watch the Ted Bundy tapes on Netflix because I watched the movie last night. It was incredible, just by the way. But I feel like I probably shouldn't watch that at night. It doesn't really seem like the vibe. But we'll see. I'm gonna take off my makeup, brush my teeth, get ready for bed, and go to bed. Hello, good morning. It is 11 a.m. I've been up for a few hours now, but I just got a package and I wanted to unbox it with you guys. It's a few days later. It's been very busy. My life became so drastically hectic, like in a blink. Like it just, I don't know. I've been so busy and there's something that like, I haven't been vlogging, but that'll be changing soon. I don't know, we, we'll get into it probably maybe in the next vlog, but today is going to be a busy day. I wanna package up like 30 Poshmark orders that I got yesterday after I posted my main channel video. In case you haven't seen it, I posted a main channel video getting rid of like half of my closet. I really, like really did it. I struggle with getting rid of things and like, I'm just such a hoarder. I just finally got rid of it and like purged so much stuff and I feel so good about it, except that I have like literally 300 pieces of clothing just sitting waiting to be sold. So I'm gonna have those items up in my Poshmark until I move, which is sometime this year, maybe in the next six months, I don't really know. Again, lots of updates to share with you guys, but that'll be for another time. And then once I end up moving, if whatever hasn't sold, I'm just gonna donate. So my Poshmark is linked down below if you wanna check it out. But I wanna open up these things, so let's do it. So today I'm gonna Poshmark the stuff that has been sold and like ship it out. And then at 1.30, Brian is coming to pick me up. Oh wait, I should do like a little bit of an update. It's hard because I've vlogged so much in the last two weeks, I just haven't shown you any of it. So before we get into this, I'm going to show you guys a couple clips that I hadn't shown you just so you are caught up and seeing what I've done in the last week or so. Alright, we got to Sweet Green. Katie's here. Yay! Her first time ever at Sweet Green. I hope you enjoy. It is the next day. Now I have lunch plans with Brian. I haven't seen him in so long. I haven't seen him since before St. Patrick's Day, which was like almost two months ago. Look who it is. I'm alive and well. Brian Redman. Hola. We are at Veggie Girl. He got some bowl. You said this isn't real chicken? No, it's not. I know, it looks like real chicken though. Are you sure this isn't chicken chicken? I'm absolutely positive. You I try mean, it, you let me know. I got the buffalo wings and this asparagus pea soup. Oh, he's going for yeah, it. Yeah, no, that's not chicken. <laughs> that's not chicken. Immediately. Okay, cool. I hadn't seen Brian in so long. Got to see him for lunch. Been hanging out with Katie a lot. Love that girl. And today I'm actually meeting, ooh. Oh, yes, yes, yes. Today I'm helping Brian film a video. So he's picking me up and we are going to be driving around because that is what the video is. You'll see. But this package is from Dove Whipped Body Cream. So we have three of them. Lavender and coconut milk, macadamia and rice milk, and pomegranate and shea butter. Ugh, those all smell so awesome. You can never go wrong with too many body lotions. Thank you so much, Dove, for these new little goodies. And the next package is from Revolve. There is gonna be a ton of stuff in here. I actually got a package from them yesterday or two days ago. Let me show you. So the first thing I got in that package, new pair of girlfriend denim shorts. These are a little bit of a darker wash than I've had. So comfy so cute they're perfectly distressed like i just i love these then i got this little top so pretty i just love the little detailing on it and then i just got this bodysuit it's like that trendy one shoulder thing that's happening nice pop of color and then this box is gonna be like packed last year all i did was dream of working with revolve like it was on the top of my wish list for this year was to work with revolve and the fact that they work with me every month is like the most insane thing ever. I'm just so thrilled. Oh my God. I'm so excited. There is a ridiculous amount of stuff in here. Like I actually can't even believe it. This is like a really deep, it's deep in here. Holy crap. Okay. So the first thing I see is this little scrunchie. I love a good scrunchie and this one was just so cute. Look how fun it is. I'll have all this and what I just showed you linked down below by the way. Okay. Let's get into the clothing. Why are you gonna do that right now? What are you even doing? There's no leaves out there to blow. We're gonna have to go over the sound of that. That's so annoying. I hope you guys can't hear it. So I have this pair of shorts, so pretty and floral and girly. These are from Lovers and Friends. They also have a romper version of this, but they didn't have my size. It's also like a very like silky satiny material. Super pretty. Next we have a bodysuit. This is a black bodysuit, but I thought it was so cool. It has like this buckle. 
That's so cool. I just liked the little detail, although this thing seems kind of big. Then we have this skirt, just a little striped skirt. I want to wear more skirts, so this is a step in the right direction, I think. This is also lovers and friends. Next up, I think this is a romper. I am honestly so thrilled. I can't believe this is my life. I just can't. Little polka dot romper, but it's not really polka dots. They're kind of like different, if you can see that. It has like this little belt to tie it. Perfect for summer and like on a little cooler day, just throw on a jean jacket or something. Oh my God, I'm obsessed. Then we have, I think this is a bodysuit. This is so cute. Here's a little bodysuit. It's a striped, it laces up in the front. So pretty and it's actually so soft. I love the little frill at the top. It's just like a cute little detail. Love this. Then we have, funny, I feel like I started this vlog talking about how I just purged a ton of clothes and now I'm getting a bunch more. So I have this shirt next, so it's very plain from the front, but like totally open back if you can see. That's so pretty. The material's kind of thicker too, which is nice. I don't wear anything that's like super open back like that. I just thought it would be really pretty. And since it's white, it'll go with literally everything. Next up we have this dress. It's very spring summer. So cute. Okay, here's the dress. Love it. It's just like this blue with flowers all over it and then it ties in the front. So pretty. And it's also a very just nice material. I am so set with summer clothes now and like cute summer clothes not just living in my shorts i'm definitely still gonna live in my shorts but i will try to also live in cute dresses and rompers this is so pretty it looked amazing on the model i'm much shorter than the model so i don't really know how it's gonna look on me but i got this like midi dress if you can see it is so pretty i love the little cutout in the front love the stripes i love the colors this is beautiful next up we have a little tank top that i have to tie the sleeves to it's a cute little color as you can see i'm really trying to branch out in the color world and add more color to my closet. If you watched the Nation on video, you saw most of my clothes like white and black. So we're trying. Love the little fringies. Oh my God, there's still like a ton of stuff in here. Next we have a set. So the first thing is this jacket. Very bold, but we love that. And then it actually has a matching skirt. I don't know if I'll ever wear it together. It might be a little too bold for me. Here's the bottoms. Look how fun. Like if you really want to go crazy, you get the set. Either way, I'll definitely wear these individually. Then we have another jean jacket. This one is a cropped black washed jacket. I just thought it looked really cool. It's just like different because all my jean jackets are lighter except for now okay two things left we have a pair of jean shorts so these are like different they have um this braided material on the front on the back they're just different than my typical pair of shorts these are super down so they're definitely less expensive than the girlfriend denim ones in case you're looking for like a cheaper alternative that's still nice quality and then lastly we have a pair of jeans i am out of breath <laughs> cute okay so i got a pair of white jeans because i don't own any and i feel like in the summer it'd be nice to have a pair of just lighter jeans these are also super down so they're more affordable for sure and i have 12 oh crap Okay, so it's 11.30. I have like an hour and a half until Brian's gonna come over unless I wanna ask him to push it. I have to get to work. All right, guys, I am good to go. I showered, did my hair, did my makeup, got out of my Disney sweater. I have been living in it because it's just so comfy. Heading out right now because Brian's gonna be here in five minutes and then we're gonna go film his video. I'll get a little bit of that for you guys because I think it's gonna be really funny. I'm just excited to see what happens because I love watching the letting the person in front of me decide what I eat videos. That's what we're doing. I don't know if I said that. So we'll see what uh, Brian's eating today and I guess I will also be eating some of it. And uh, we're gonna go. You know, you complain about... Why are you parked so far away? There's spots here and they're always taken and this is always open. Look oh. at the, the outfit. Well, it was a comfy day. I got it sent to me for free. You got a matching little sweatsuit. I think it's like a, is it a tracksuit? Oh, it's a tracksuit. First stop of the day. Alright. It's so retro. It is so cool. I hope you can turn in here. Yeah, you can. No, you cannot. No, you can't. What are you doing? Oh my gosh, here we go. Here we go. This is like the second weirdest thing I've ever had to do in a drive. I hope there's a lot of people in that car. I don't think so, but it is a minivan, so that makes me a little nervous. What do you think he's gonna order? Probably... Mmm, a latte with almond milk. Mmm, wouldn't that be nice? He's probably gonna get like some black coffee, you know, like... No, it's gonna be like very manly. Yeah. Black coffee, extra black, <laughs> extra... Did you just fall? Yes. How do you fall when you're already sitting? Well, I just, I... It's fine. Are you falling for me? We went down this road. It didn't work out. <laughs> <laughs> Woo, baby! You're having fun today. Uh, oh my god! Can you imagine if that was my dream? <laughs> Why? That dude's got. He just oh, walked away with twelve coffees. That would have been so freaking Dude, I funny. I swear, if that would have been me, I would have been. Oh, I was gonna say that. Oh, that one. I have my wallet. Hell yeah, Tara! Tara surprise. Oh my god! All right. I don't want to know what he orders. I oh, want it to be a basic. Okay. I hope that he's like 
of getting stuff for everybody and that it's gonna be a ton of stuff so we I, can I sample literally. everything. This is like a cool challenge, but it's also the dumbest challenge ever to do when you're hungry. You should do this challenge when you don't care. Break is like, what if you get something disgusting? Yeah, then you're screwed. And I don't eat all kinds of meat. Oh yeah? You know this. You don't eat what, red meat? Why do you not? I tell you things and you just don't absorb No, I just want to make sure like things, you know, things can change. So like I was like, oh, maybe she updated what she Absolutely eats. Absolutely not. No? Did I only happen? eat chicken. Yeah, I know. And sushi. What, what kind of sushi you think Yeah, I California eat? sushi. Absolutely not. Vegan sushi. Sushi without meat that's not chicken. <laughs> no backing out now. I wonder if he maybe got like a donut cake pop too because it's on the screen there. That'd be nice. Hello so there. Hey, how you doing? Amazing. I want to get exactly what the person in front of me got. Say it again? I want to get exactly what the person in front of me just ordered. I want exactly the, the same thing. Yeah, I don't want to know what it is. I just want to get it. Yeah, it's one of you guys. <laughs> it's one of you guys? Wait, has there been one before? Uh, yeah. How many? So far, two. <laughs> I'm so unoriginal. Yeah. Alright, man. Thanks very much. Alright. Alright, I'll see you over there. I'll see you. Alright, man. All right, I don't they're think gonna that's get it. There's no way that's the guy. No, that's totally. The oh, look, he's getting his thing. Thank you, thank you. Uh, yes, yes please, because I want to know what we got. Yeah. Hey, so the person in front it was like a fifty dollar order. That's what I said. <laughs> I said you guys gonna screw me over. You yeah. could have been like, oh, hey, yo, he ordered like yeah. ten coffees. Thanks, buddy. Hey, thank you, you too. Thank you. You want to see what it is? Yeah, what is it? Oh, stop, Brian. A grande ice vanilla latte. <laughs> No way, this is my dream. <laughs> what the heck? I'm gonna go give the guy in front of me a hug. Literally cannot believe no they ordered way. your order to a T. No fucking way, dude. I take it back, this is the best challenge ever. Holy shit, though. This is the best challenge ever. I don't want to expose too much of Brian's video, so I'm gonna have it linked down below for when it goes live. It's going live on Saturday. God, thank you so much. Yes, when does this go live? Aw, tomorrow. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Wow, you get it up that quick? <laughs> yeah. I post Monday, Thursday. Really? Yep. I didn't know it was a schedule. I do Monday, Thursday now. It keeps me in check. Oh, look at this dude running. I know, I noticed him. You get it, man. Go, 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 go. Now we are just gonna go, go and do the, the next spots. So you'll see that in his video, because again, I just don't want to take too much of his video from him. Wow. So. Well, you're, so, you're so generous. Wow, thank you Must so be a Canadian much. thing. It is. It's every day, bro. <laughs> J. Cole. Look at this, Look at this house. house. That's incredible. What? That's so nice. Bro, that is huge. These houses These are, are huge. crazy. See, this drive doesn't seem so bad when you get to look at all this fun stuff. It is true. Turn your post notifications on so we get more views and get a house like this. Woo! Welcome to my cribs. Just pulling up to my house. Tara could have had this if she wanted Oh to. my god! You're so annoying. <laughs> Jesus. Anyways, I was gonna say that this house like looks like it's straight out of Italy. Wow, I completely forgot to vlog when I got back. In my head, I took a clip and I was like, hey guys, just got back. But I guess I just didn't do it. But I've been home for a little bit. It is now almost seven o'clock and I'm about to head out, go to dinner. I will not be vlogging for the rest of the night though. So I guess I'm gonna end the vlog here. I'm wearing my new little scrunchie. I think it's a really cute. It feels like so young but i like it and then i'm wearing the bodysuit that i got with a cute little buckle going to dinner in culver city gonna go to downtown culver and uh that's it for the vlog guys i hope you guys enjoyed this video i hope you guys are excited slash i know you guys are all excited that i'm back in la because nobody likes disney vlogs it's okay i completely understand it's very repetitive content and it's just like rides and then talking and then rides it's just like it's it's more fun to be there than to watch it, you know? That's how I've always felt about Disney vlogs, so I completely understand. Regardless, I like those vlogs for my own memories. So I'm not mad that I vlogged it and posted it. But yeah, I love you guys. I'm so excited to be vlogging more in LA. And I'll see you on Monday with another vlog. Mm -hmm.